A high performance road bicycle tire is inflated to a total pressure of 132 PSI. What is this pressure in millimeters of mercury? So we need to convert PSI to millimeters of mercury. We have to use two conversion factors from table 6.1 because we don't have a direct conversion from PSI to millimeters of mercury. So we know that one atmosphere is 14.7 PSI and 760 millimeters of mercury is one atmosphere. So we can convert from PSI to atmospheres to millimeters of mercury. Okay, so the way to solve this problem is to start with 132 PSI. We know that 14.7 PSI is one atmosphere. 760 millimeters of mercury is one atmosphere. So now atmospheres cancels, okay? PSI cancels, and we're left with millimeters of mercury. So we multiply 132 times one times 760 and divide by 14.7, okay? And so our answer is 6.82 times 10 to the third millimeters of mercury. So now we'll work the four practice problem. Your local weather report announces that the barometric pressure is 30.44 inches of mercury. We need to convert this pressure to PSI. So we need to convert inches of mercury to PSI. Okay, so let's see what uh, information we know. So if you look at table 6.1, you'll see that one atmosphere is equal to 29.92 inches of mercury and 14.7 psi is equal to one atmosphere. So now we can set up our problem. So we're going to convert inches of mercury to atmospheres using the one atmosphere is 29.92 inches of mercury conversion factor. And then we'll convert atmospheres to PSI using 14 point clean that up. Using 14.7 PSI. Is one atmosphere. Okay. So let's go ahead and set it up. 30.44 inches of mercury is what we're starting with. One atmosphere is 29.92 inches of mercury. So we need to put inches of mercury on the bottom. And 14.7 PSI is one atmosphere. Okay, so let's cancel our units. So atmosphere cancels, inches of mercury cancels, and we're left with PSI. Okay, so we're going to multiply 30.44 times 1 times 14.7, and then we would multiply 29.92 times 1, then divide the top by the bottom. So I've, I'm just going to give the final answer here. That's 15.0 PSI. Okay, so we have a four more practice problem as well. Like this, so I'm going to go ahead and work that one. Convert a pressure of 23.8 inches of mercury to kilopascal. Okay, so I'm just going to work this one directly. It's worked in the same way. 23.8 inches of mercury. Okay, and one atmosphere is 29.92 inches of mercury and 101.325 kilopascal is one atmosphere okay so what cancels inches of mercury cancels atmospheres cancels and we're left with kilopascal which is what we were looking for so we multiply everything on the top and everything on the on the bottom and divide the top by the bottom that gives us 80.6 kilopascals in the 